This is the GitHub page for this project. It requires Python 3.10. Go to the Python site and click Downloads. Scroll down and find Python 3.10.11. Scroll down and click the Windows 64-bit installer. Now run the installer. Check the Add Python to Pathbox and click Install now. When that is done, go back to the GitHub page. Scroll down and click the automatic installer link. Download the zip file. Move it to a convenient location and extract it. Double click the Windows batch file. Now you can delete the batch files and zip file. Go into the new audio UI folder. Scroll down and double click the run batch file. This will take some time. If this completes successfully for you, great. But I received an access is denied error. So I'm going to close this and rerun that same run batch file. This time, I get a different error message saying the version of NumPy is not correct. I'm going to solve this by manually installing the correct version. Close this window and scroll up and double-click the activate-only batch file. Type in this command to install the correct version. I will put this command in the description of this video. I received more errors here, but I'm going to ignore them as they don't seem to cause any issues with running the application. Now let's rerun that run batch file. Say that five times fast. This time the install finished successfully. Let's copy paste the URL to a browser. This application has text to speech, RVC, audio LDM, audio craft, whisper, voice training, and a denoising utility. Because I am lazy, I am going to add a flag so that this UI starts automatically without needing to copy paste the URL to a browser. Go into the web UI folder. Edit the web UI Python file. After this comma, add another entry called in browser equals true and add another comma. Then save and exit. Now double click the run batch file and the UI should open on its own. I used this app for a couple days and really liked the voice training and RVC for voice cloning functionality. In the future, I will probably make another video with details on using the different features.